Pajon District Prosecutor's Office visited 37 locations and summoned more than 50 people for questioning in relation to a military procurement scandal. The target of the probe is a Taiwan-made armored vehicle, the Clouded Leopard, which has been plagued by inferior parts in key systems. Visits were paid to Zhongxin Electric and Machinery Manufacturing, as well as the number 209 factory of the Ministry of National Defense's Armaments Bureau. The Ministry of National Defense is fond of displaying this clouded leopard armored vehicle. But few know that the vehicle has been hampered by numerous issues, such as the cracking of steel plates and other major defects. The tension in the steel plating is insufficient, and so is its hardness. The turret's firepower is also insufficient. The Taichung District Prosecutor's Office suspects that some of the materials and equipment and the clouded leopard were swapped for inferior substitutes. This has sparked a major judicial investigation into potential collusion between the military and its subcontractors. If evidence can be found of any person illegally impacting this purchase, the Ministry of National Defense will fully cooperate with prosecutors to investigate and severely punish those responsible. The Clouded Leopard armored vehicle was thought to have a minimum bid beginning at 7.8 billion NT, though the manufacturer submitted a winning bid of just 4.8 billion. How do you account for a 3 billion difference? The manufacturer also needs to make a profit. We may found that they used inferior materials to try to minimize cost. What was to be a source of pride in producing Taiwan's first locally made armored vehicle has now become a source of embarrassment, plagued by corruption and improper dealings.